Good morning, Jai Krishna. Good morning, ma'am. Okay, can I know about yourself? Good morning, ma'am. First of all, thanking you, thanking you for giving this opportunity to introduce myself. My name is Jai Krishna. I am from Kauli, but I am currently staying in Hyderabad. I did my graduation in B.Tech from Chevron Engineering College, in the stream of Computer Science and Engineering, the aggregation of 65 percentage. I have communication. I have some technical skills for Java, manual testing, and uh, some basics of uh, SQL. Coming to my family background, we are four. We are five members, include me, my sister, sisters, and uh, my mother and uh, my father. Uh, my strength is uh, I am a honest and uh, a quick learner, a disciplined person. In coming to my uh, short term goal is I, I get a job in MNC company and my long term goal is I, I will be a better position to achieve uh, where I am working. My hobbies are reading books, playing cricket, uh, listening music. So that's about me, ma'am. Okay. Core Java is completed, right? Yes, ma'am. Okay. From Core Java, I will ask you a few questions. You yes, need to answer those questions. Yes, okay. yes, problem. Yes, okay. And tell me, what is compiler? Compiler is a program that will translate high-level programming language into low-level programming language. That's called compiler. Okay. What is high-level language? High-level language is a human human what code written in a human record format that is called high level language. Okay. What about source code? Source code is a, a collection, uh, collection of instructions written using human readable programming language uh, using uh, plain as text. What about bytecode? Bytecode is a program. It is uh, it is converts from source code into bytecode. That's called bytecode. It is a middle level language from source code to mission language, mission code. Okay. Please explain few Java features. Java is having more features. I want to tell some few features. It is Java is a simple and a readable format. It is a secure language and it is a robust language. It, uh, it is a portable language and it is a robust, robust means strong and it is also a object oriented programming language. It is, uh, uh, is uh, multi-threading language. Okay. What is object oriented programming language? Why Java object oriented programming language? Object -oriented, uh, Java is an object oriented programming language. It allows to follow the some concepts. That's uh, abstraction, encapsulation, inheritance, and polymorphism. Okay. What is polymorphism? Polymorphism is a concept in which one operation exhibit, one operation perform, exhibit different uh, different behaviors in different situations. It's called polymorphism. Can you please uh, real, uh, explain real time example of polymorphism? Okay. If uh, suppose if you take one person, he goes to office. He 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 will do the job as an employee, and he will goes to near to children. He he do the job as father, and he will uh, goes to the sibling. He he will do the job as a as a brother. Here, the person is same, but uh, its uh, behavior is different uh, depending on. Uh, situation. Yes. Okay. How many types of polymorphism are there? Uh, the polymorphism is mainly two types. They are static and uh, dynamic polymorphism. Please explain dynamic polymorphism. Dynamic polymorphism done at uh, compile time through method overriding. Okay. Explain method overriding. Method overriding is a concept uh, in which <coughs> Um, uh, uh, redefining the functionalities of the parent class. Okay. Few differences between method overriding and method overloading. Mm, method over method overloading method is same, parameter is also same, element also same are different. 
but uh, return type must is return type is must answer same with the two methods in method of overriding parameters also same method uh, return type also same that is the difference between method of overloading and overriding okay what is inheritance inheritance is a concept in which acquiring the properties of parent class is called inheritance okay is there any types in inheritance? Yes, there are uh, mainly four types. Single inheritance, multi-level inheritance, hybrid inheritance, hierarchical inheritance. Here one, one of the inheritance is the multiple inheritance, but Java is not uh, supporting uh, multi-level multiple inheritance. Okay. Why Java not support multiple inheritance? In, uh, because of ambiguity situations, multiple inheritance is not support Java. That's uh, ambiguity situation is, means if some, uh, multiple inheritance we is uh, having two parent class and only one child class. If there is uh, two parent class having same method name. Uh, if, we, if we create an object to child class, then we call method. Then we will go ambiguity situation. It's called uh, ambiguity. What is an array? Array is a data structure. It's a collection of similar data type with a fixed uh, memory size. Okay. How many types of array support are there? There are mainly two types are there. Static and dynamic array. Explain dynamic array. Uh, in dynamic array, if you create an array without giving the size, it's called a dynamic array. Yeah, fine. Okay now, I'll give you one program, okay. then you need to write the program, okay? okay. Is it okay for you? Yes ma'am. Okay. Please write the, okay, please write down the program for palindrome. Just uh, you take one number, the number is palindrome or not. Okay. By using Java, just you need to write that. Okay. Okay, okay. I can write. If you take one class, public class, and uh, we have to take some variables, integer variables, int, n is equal to, we will take one number, one to one, and uh, we will store some, then we will take one variable, that is some, and uh, we will store uh, reverse r, we will take r, then we will take main method, public, static void main in this main method we will have to take one loop one while loop in this while loop we will write one condition suppose suppose if we take one number one to one we will check this one to one number is a palindrome or not and we will check condition n greater than 0 and we will write the condition n is equal to the number is uh, remainder by 10 and we will store this sum into a sum sum is equal to this number sum is equal to, here it takes sum is equal to 0. Sum into 10 plus this number. Sum stored in sum, or r is equal to reverse. Suppose you will take one number 1 to 1, this reverse uh, we have start the equation of the, this part, store this number into this uh, n by 10. This is the condition about palindrome number. And uh, if we check the number is palindrome or not, then we will write if first condition. If sum equal to equal to this number, then 
then this number is called palindrome. This number out of internal palindrome number. Yes. Not a palindrome. It's a, then we will close the main method in class. It's about palindrome. Here we will take number 1 to 1. 1 to 1 divided by 100, then we will get 1. Pn sum r. In this condition, we get the one, one to one. Sum, sum equal to zero. Sum into zero into ten, zero plus n. N what is n? One. Yes, sum we will get one. R. R is nothing but 1 to 1 divided by 10, then also we will get 1. Here, here, here the R is a 1 first. Then we will go to the check n, n 1 to 1 greater than 0, then we will go to the sum. Here, sum, will, sum is 1. 1 into 10, 10 plus n 2 here sum is 12 r is also 12 then we will execute the condition and we will check, check the number condition is true and come here 1 to 1 execute the and sum is equal to 1, 1 to 1 sum is 12 here and the next condition only as we had in here and R is 1 to 1, 12, 1 to 1, sum 12. This is the same as if you take, you will take number 1 to 1, then you will get the output as 1 to 1, then execute the if condition, sum equal to equal to n, then we will print the, it is the parent row number. Okay, Jai Krishna. Uh, your coding skill is good okay. and uh, your communication is a little bit uh, less. Okay. So you need to improve your body damage also like your eye contact. Okay. 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 Yeah, next time you will be better. Okay. okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you.